Hello everyone, this is Caleb here, and I'm going to show you how to use my latest version of my tool, BootGIF, which turns a GIF, like this, into an animated boot logo for your device. So first thing you do is you're going to open up BootGIF. It's a cross-platform Java program, so it should look the same on Windows, Mac, Linux. Alright, so we're going to select the GIF, which is in uh, desktop, uh, yeah, lego.gif. Alright, uh, there it is. Alright, so since I have a white iPhone and a GIF with a white background, I think it makes sense to have a white background on the uh, boot logo. Um, I want it a little bigger than that, so I'll choose fit width. You can also fit height, fit both. That looks kind of weird. Um, anyway, so I think fit width makes sense for this. Um, and say I don't want it to be really long, so I'm going to limit the number of frames. 25 frames makes sense. Uh, this means that it's not going to cut the GIF short, it's just going to take out some frames in the middle of it to shorten it to 25 frames. Though if I loop it, this will be 50 frames, this will be 75, this will be 100. Uh, it, it limits the number of frames in the GIF, not the number of frames in the animation. So keep that in mind if you're going to use that option. Um, also, the fade is not limited. So this means if you have a fade in, so this goes from the Apple logo to the first frame of the GIF, but I have a white iPhone and a white GIF, so it makes sense to do white. Um, so we'll have it fade in for, say, 10 seconds. Um, or, sorry, not seconds, frames. Um, they won't be limited by the limit frames option. I have an iPhone 5, so I'm going to click this. Select output just means where do you want the GIF to show up. I want it on my desktop. So you can just easily move it into, into my device. Um, and I think we're ready to create the boot logo. So it tells you what the file name is going to be. It's somewhat random. Um, it's based on the, the current time. That's just so if you want to create multiple logos, they'll have different names, but you just don't have to like name them uh, in the program, which would be kind of a hassle. All right, so that's done. Uh, so this is our boot logo if we want to see how it turned out. Um, so as you can see, it starts out with the white Apple logo, and then goes through the GIF four times. Um, okay, so I think we're ready to put it on our device. Uh, here's iFunbox where I'm going to put the boot logo animation in. You navigate to raw file system, library, boot logos, and if you have animate installed, this should already exist, you'll see that. Okay, so now that we put the boot logo on the device, uh, um, can do is unlock it, go into settings, um, and go into uh, boot logo, and then we're going to choose this one. We can preview it, and so that's what it's going to look like. All right, so then we can do. Let's turn the device off.